Hello, and this is Dan and Lee from Born to Clutch Films, and we're going to be talking about the current recession that the UK is in, and our opinions on it, how we would resolve it and all this. It's going to be quite a little fun thing. We're going to start doing more sort of topic commentaries, because we do them over Skype. We just find it better to do rather than live, because my mic's fucked as well. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're going to be talking about the recession, and... Pretty much. The banks and everything have got us into big shit, haven't they? That's an... Well, I don't... Yeah, that, yeah, they have. Like, at least we're not as bad as other countries. We kind of resolved it a bit. Yeah. I mean, like, look at Greece and stuff. Like, they're doomed. They're fucked, pretty much. There's no way they're getting out of that. Nah. I suppose we are kind of coping with it a bit. I mean, like... You notice shops closing and unemployment level going up, but I mean, it's nothing as bad as other countries. Yeah. I know what you mean. We got off with it luckily, I say. Yeah. Oh, nice triple there, by the way. So I'm just watching your gameplay. What map's it on? Um, it is on Resistance, I do believe. Alright, oh, yeah, yeah. Not that I can remember that, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, um. Do you know all that rioting in London yeah. last year? Mm -hmm. That was like a load of sh like they're the people, other than the bankers, that completely ruin this country. Mm -hmm. Like I don't know. That's going off topic. Back to the recession. Yeah, I know what you mean though. They Look, like got this country into a worse situation. Yeah, the UK isn't that bad though. No. And we, I just think like. Oh yeah, my name's David Cameron, and I'm gonna cut the bloody all the things that are important, like the police, the army. I mean, what's the point in cutting the army? We don't really. There's parts of the army where I can understand. Ab. But I don't know. I don't like uh, what's his face, Tony Blair, and the fat one, um, Gordon, Gordon Brown. Brown. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> um, they ruin this country. Like David Cameron's tried to bring it back, but yeah, he's tried his best. There's not a lot you can do when the country is in that much of a shithole. Yeah, I know what you mean. You just come in like whoops, crap. It was my window. Um, Our government's buggered. Yeah. I mean, I don't know too much about the recession, but it's affecting a lot of people. Like. Mm. You've got all the benefits, cuts, and all that. Some of the benefits I believe in, but people are just taking the piss with it. Yeah. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but people were really... They were, like, fraud in the government, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, my God, I feel a sneeze coming on. That's never good. Taking out money that they don't need to. and. Yeah, like... Yes. I don't know, like... Uh, there's two things I want to say. One of them I can get away with. The other one's borderline offensive to some people. One of them is chabs on benefits, if you get what I mean. Like, yeah, you have all these it's people. always the council house people. Yeah, like... The, like, uh, the parents who only have... Like, they're single parents and they have, like, 50 kids and they're, like, yeah. like a scam off the, like, government and their fathers to get maintenance and all that. And they're the ones that go around, like, I don't complaining. know. Complaining. They go yeah. around complaining and they're, like, oh, you ain't done nothing for me, blood, in it. <laughs> and they're the ones, like, who have got the car given to them, got the house given to them. Yeah. They get money, like, they do fuck all. They sit in a house all day and have babies. Yeah, I know. But they do. And smoke weed and shit. Yeah, I know. They, ha they can afford to, like... <laughs> they can afford to fund their drug addictions and alcohol, but, but they, they can't... can't... to look after their kids, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's the big... <laughs> People like that should be de deported to... Uh, what country don't I really like? Actually, I won't say that. What country is pointless at the moment? To Greece. Yeah. Because Greece are in a recession, and see how they live there. 
Ah. I don't know. <laughs> what would you do if you was the president? The president. The president. <laughs> um. I would. All illegal immigrants should be deported immediately. No question about it. Yeah. Just here's a boat. Bugger off. <laughs> um. Immigrants that come over here and don't work exactly the same because they're not useful to us. Even people that don't want to work and just scam off the benefits. Yeah. Even if they're like British, bugger off. We don't want you on our island, like that. Yeah, like send them to. Yeah, that's a good idea. You've just reminded me. Send them to Ireland. Ireland. If we move all decent Irish people to England, Scotland, Wales, all that. And then all total knobheads can be sent to Ireland. I don't want to go to Ireland. <laughs> oh, yeah, I see your point. No, we don't. We don't like scam the government, though. Yeah, I know. I don't. I think that's stupid, though. How they complain about it. On the other hand, they're taking the mic, pretty much. Yeah, they are. Like, I don't oh. know. I don't it's know. Fine. It's hard to speak about this because every time I start speaking, I just rage at people i'm like yeah you knobheads what are you doing i don't know i just think businesses need to like employ the good people that can do a multiple of jobs mm. if you know what i mean so i don't know how to explain it but let's think of van sheeran for example right? <laughs> yeah <laughs> we're sort of a network and that like if Nick recruited one person that was a channel manager a moderator and a recruiter he wouldn't have to employ three people would he like you employ the good people that's but, how I run my business but I suppose you're putting a lot of pressure on that one person but not just that that's three jobs gone to one person so that's like yeah four, yeah that's four out of jobs but I'm just saying, like... I know what you mean, though. The cuts... I don't know, the police is about the worst thing to cut. In some places, I think it can be cut. I think it's, like... Member of, like, people who work in the government. Like, we have 50 trillion gazillion people, as far as I can see, that do fuck all. Yeah. Like, you have... Do you know, like... You see on the news and whatever, like, occasionally it comes up that someone said bomb in the Houses of Parliament and there's, like, a yeah. huge thing. There's, like, 50 people there all doing nothing. Yeah, they just say other people's opinions. How easy is that? I know, and they get paid, like, loads for it. Yeah, and they, like, they scam the government. Yeah. Like, you hear <laughs> stories exactly like, fun. oh, yeah, they stole, like, seven grand or whatever. But I just thought, yeah... We're the, only co we're the only country that has pounds, right? Yep. We own the Bank of England. Why don't we just print more money? That's what I said to my mum once, to be honest. I said, if we're in a recession, print a few extra couple of million, give it to banks, here we go, here's some fake money, now f don't fuck it up again. Yeah. Like, it's just thinking harm as well. anyone. Do you remember our London Riot video we done on MW2? Yeah. We got to link that in the description. Okay. It was like a little piss take London Riot thing that we done on Modern Warfare 2.5. That was a pretty fun game and time. So yeah, our opinion of the recession, Lee, what is it? Um, Deport all the immigrants. Get rid of illegal Yeah, immigrants. actually. Bring all good Irish people to England, Scotland and Wales and send all knobheads to Ireland to live on their own. Um, Companies offer, need to offer more jobs. Yes. The government, the government, instead of getting rid of jobs, they need to, like, make jobs. Like, yeah. Instead of, in, instead of spending money on politicians' seven houses, spend it on helping a business grow and stuff. Yeah, I know what you mean. And, like, people need to get off their asses, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. Everyone needs to go down the job centre. Yeah, pretty much. Which is what I'm going to do as soon as I leave college. 
Yeah, I'm gonna look for a job. Squeaky door. <laughs> yeah, that was the cover. Okay. Uh, oh, it's coming to the end of this gameplay now. We got about I'd love to be in the government. Okay, end this real quick. Ideal job, like anything in in the world. Like, what would you do? What anything like even money? Yep, we got like twenty seconds. Quick. Um, accountant or yeah. opening doors for the um roller coasters. Right. <laughs> mine would be like uh, mine would be like a full time YouTuber syndicate type person if that makes sense. Like mm -hmm. it just does YouTube. That'd be pretty amazing. Yeah, that would be good. Oh, we've over one. Oh well. So rate, comment, subscribe. This has been the recession. You see more of these coming soon. We're out. Bye. Bye-bye.